Hey guys, Joe and I are here today at Universal Studios Orlando at Lowe's Sapphire Falls Resort Hotel and we're going to go into Amatista's Cookhouse and have some lunch. Let's go check this place out. I've heard great things about it so I'm super excited. This is our view from our table. Yes it is. I'm going to get the tropical salad. It's 14 bucks. It's greens, papaya, mandarins, powder palms, pickled red onions, candy pecans, and passion fruit vinaigrette. That just sounds so good to me. I don't know if I'm going to add any protein to it or not. It sounds good to add some, but I don't know that I need that much. But the salad just sounds good to me. <laughs> I've, been, I've been like craving a salad weirdly, so let's see what Joe's going to have. Well, I'm down to two choices, either mm -hmm. the island fish sandwich mm -hmm. or the meat lover's flatbread. And I'm kind of leaning towards the meat lover's uh, flatbread because you know I love pizza. All right, I got the tropical salad. It was 14 bucks. I decided to go ahead and add the pan-seared shrimp to it, which is an extra 10, so 24 bucks for my salad. It looks and smells amazing. And then Joe got the meat lover. Meat lover flatbread. Meat lover flatbread. It actually looks good. Do you know what the price that was? I do not. I was thinking of it. I'll have to look that up. I'll have to look that up. Anyhow, let's check this out. So there is mine. It looks delicious. Those candied, I think it's candied pecans on there. That looks amazing. I mean, the whole thing just looks super good. And then Joe got the meat lovers flatbread. I don't know why he goes on vacation over his pizza, but he's a pizza guy and he's a burger guy, so that's what he's gonna get. For me, I try to get stuff that maybe I wouldn't necessarily get at home so that I can try a different experience. But as long as he's happy, it's all that matters. <laughs> Ain't that right? right? That is right. So let me see what he thinks of his flatbread. He says the crust is right. Of course, he said that when the camera was off. So what do you think? I like the sauce. The cheese is good. A uh, good amount of meat. Yeah. Is the crust good? For me, it's all about the crust, and not everybody makes a good crust. Well, it's got a little bit of crisp on the crust, but yes, the, the top has just got a little bit of juice to it, so it's good. So now, is the sauce, is it more like a tangy kind of sauce, or is it a sweet sauce? Is it like a marinara? It's got a little bit of sweet to it. Okay. See, I like a sweet yeah. on the sauce, like more like a marinara style. Let's give this a test drive. Hi. That's good. This might get a little messy. Good sauce. The vinaigrette. Stronger on the vinaigrette than not really sweet. Mandarins. I always put mandarins on my salads at home. It's got the tail on shrimp. I mean, if I'm having a salad, I don't want to finger the salad. So I wish they would have taken the tails off. Wow, that's cooked perfectly. Perfectly. That is delicious. Very good. Got a little bit of a seasoning to it. A little salty seasoning. I'm not sure what all is in that seasoning. It's good. A little on the salty side, maybe. The salad's pretty good. I just was looking for something that was fairly light, and I really wanted a salad, and I was having a hard time finding any place that really had a decent salad. And then when we were walking by Amatista, we seen it on their menu, and I was like, yes, please, and thank you. So it's also got the little red onions on it. Super good. And I'm going to try a piece of candy pecan. How can you go wrong with candy pecans? i got to look this up because I can't remember what it was called. It's a little weird. 
not necessarily bad. I don't know that I would necessarily ever crave them. It's a little peculiar, peculiar to me. Is yours? Yeah, I'm not sure what it is. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know that I'm into that. This is super good. Really nice, light lunch. I didn't really want anything so heavy and then have to go out into the floor to eat in the sun. Definitely didn't want anything fried. So having a nice salad like this, yes, please and thank you. <laughs> so our final bill here at Amatista at Sapphire Falls was $46.97. That's before the uh, before the tip and everything. Don't forget to tip your server because they work their butts off to make sure that you have a great vacation. So please show your appreciation by giving them a good tip. And of course, I preach that a lot. And also, if you're a pass holder, make sure you rock those pass holder discounts because it adds up and it pays for itself over a very brief period of time. But Amatista here at Universal Studios Orlando absolutely incredible. We will be back. If you are new to this channel, please hit that like and subscribe and ring bell notification so you don't miss out on the latest and greatest. Also, please don't forget to check out some of our other great videos we have on the parks, the rides, resorts, resort rooms, Skyliner rides, day trips, car shows, outdoor pizza oven videos, Universal Studios, Islands of Adventure, and Disney World. Thank you so much for watching.